What's going on guys and welcome back to another video. I hope you're enjoying the sun and staying safe at the same time. As you can see in the title below, I will be doing a 24 skill challenge, which is 24 skills in 24 hours. I've seen quite a lot of YouTubers do this. Chris MD's done it, the Sidemen's done it, and a few other YouTubers have done it. It's a great way to stay productive, to go outside and enjoy the sun. And I recommend you guys do it at home. If you want to compete against your family or do it on your own, it's a great way to see what kind of skills you can actually do. So these are the skills I'm going to choose to do today. I'm going to try and do the easy ones first. Then I'm going to make my way to the harder ones. It's currently one o'clock, so I've got to do one o'clock tomorrow to complete them all. And yeah, let's see how I get on. So please like, share and subscribe. And let's get on to it. So the first trick is around the world. Stretch out my groin. So I don't think I can count the last one because I did fall over. So let's try and nail it properly. Oh. Boom! So the next trick is spin the ball on my finger for three seconds. Was that? No? <laughs> Do it again. Oh, that, that was, that was, was well good! <laughs> so the next trick is the ball flip. Make sure you stay hydrated in hot conditions like this. Right, if I get the first one, I think I can do it. One, two, three. Ah, oh, so close. <laughs> Two. Oh, come on, man. Where you go to the table? Right, we'll change your location because my knees hurt. Look at that. Seven bottle flips. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yay! Yes. <laughs> yes. So now I'm going to do a handstand. I think we smashed the um, handstand, so we're going to try and do the cartwheel now. I'm scared. <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> I thought I had it. I watched the tutorial and they told me to do this. Oh, I'm wondering if it's got to be right. I think that's the best cartwheel I'm going to do. Not very good at cartwheels. Can you do a better one? Put in the comments below and tell me how good you are at cartwheels. Best I can do. On to the next one. So the next skill is juggling. We don't have any juggling balls, so we've got little potatoes. So let's give it a go. 10 seconds.
Was that it? So I think I'm gonna class that one as 10 seconds, even though it ended a bit sloppy, but that's the best you're gonna get from me. <laughs> On to the next one. So the next skill I'm gonna do is the skipping rope challenge. I've gotta do three skips in one jump. So I'll do it three times in one jump. Did that do it? <laughs> that one needs to count. That was free. Hey. That was free. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. So we took it to the VAR and I didn't do three turns on the jump, so I'll try and do it again. So we changed the rope. This one is slightly heavier, more of a speed rope, so hopefully I can do the three loops in one jump. Let's give it a go. Do it. So I think I've got the idea, so I just need to skip, then get faster and faster, then do the double, and then I can achieve the triple. So hard! I could do two, just can't do three. I'm gonna take my hat off. I'm wearing my hat. Oh, I can't do it. Fuck like this one. Shit. Card into the potatoes. This one will take ages, I can feel it. Oh my god! Oh my god, I done it! I done it! <laughs> Number five! <laughs> Look how many cards I used. Uh, it's not recording. Oh, are you serious? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna flip my chip. So, because I smashed the other one, I'm gonna do the shuffling cards. I do the first bit, but the second bit I can't do. So, shuffle the cards, all you've got to do, go like that. Put your thumbs on top, bend the cards, and go slowly release. Like that. Cut the deck, shuffle the cards. Bend it up. Oh, beautiful. Done. There you go. So I'm going to fold this t shirt in three seconds. So the little trick to this so I think you pinch the top here, pinch in the middle there, bring that down. Two. That's wrong. Let's try again. There you go. You get faster than that, 100%. You do this. There, done. Three seconds. So now I'm gonna do a hat trick. So as long as I throw it in the air and catch it on my head, I'm gonna pass that as a trick. Best I can do. Done it. Like
if I do ten of them, kick them up in the air. But. Done it. I've done more than enough. There you go. Yeah, it's an easy one. So I'm going to do that with a bit backwards. You okay. ready? Z Y X D W. Alright, okay. Z Y X W V U T S R Q P O N M L K J I H G F E D C B A. Yes! <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so now I'm going to learn the alphabet in sign language. So A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z Done it. So for my next skill, I'm going to be making a cocktail. I'll be making the Blue Lagoon, which is Blue Curacao, vodka, with some steel lemonade. So, get my ice. I'll be doing one big shot of each blue curacao and the vodka. And finish it off by topping it up with your steel lemonade. Give it a big shake. Top your glass up with ice. That should do it. Now pour the drink into the glass. And there you have it, the Blue Lagoon. The three second Malteser float challenge. Let's see if I can do this. Copy it. I think that, that was it, but I'll do one more. That's it. I'm going to attempt the moonwalk. There is a slight trick to this, so if I put it my foot up and drag and up. So let's give it a go. Okay, I've got this now. Let's do it. Now onto the origami crane. It's getting dark outside, so we have to come in. So we've got to fold it up to make a square. Like that. Now you've got a square. So fold them both ways so you get your crease. Hold down. As in, you see your kit, one of your wings is kinked. Yeah, that one. But there you go. And there you have it. What's going on guys, it's the next morning, it's half past nine, so I've got another three and a half hours of filming. I'm really tired, 
I spent all night editing, didn't go to bed until half two, but I'm here and I'm gonna smash it. So I'm gonna attempt to do the worm. I think my last worm I tried to do was the best one. I mean, I've got the rhythm with it going like that. It looked like a worm, maybe a tired worm, but definitely done it. Okay, on to the next one. So the next one I've got to do is the kip up. So I need to lay down flat on my back, then try and push up and land on my feet and stand up. Easy. It don't help that aching from yesterday. My back here is killing me. Can't do it. Being that's the best you're gonna get on the kip up. You need a lot of force coming back and jumping forward. But my back is hurting a lot from yesterday. So So now I'm gonna learn a breakdance move. And there's one I saw on YouTube, it looks pretty easy, so I'm gonna give it a go. So, start off on the floor. Like this. Then you do, like this. Then you do, one, two, three, four, five. So for the next skill, I'm going to learn 10 words in Spanish. Park. Park. Parque. <laughs> Park. School. Escuela. <laughs> what is it? Escuela. What is it? It's like maybe teaching Johnny French. Park. Parque. Aeroplane. Avio. School. Escuela. Bus. Audus. House. Casa. Fish. Pescado. Watermelon. Sandia. Ball. Ballon. TV. Tele. Computer. Ordenador. Yes. Yes. For the final skill, I'm going to make this bottle disappear. After three, it will disappear. Three, two, one, and it's gone. So guys, if you like this video, like, share, and subscribe. More videos to come. See you later.